Today I will talk on data warehouse. A data warehouse is a single, complete and consistent store of data obtained from variety of sources and made available to end users in a way they can understand and use in business context. In computing, data warehouse can be said to be a process of centralizing or aggregating the data from multiple sources into one common repository. It usually contains historical data. Let us consider an example. In a business world, a data warehouse might incorporate customer information from company's point of sale system, that is, cash register, its website, its mailing list and its comment cards. By using this information, analysis are made for business improvement. Data in data warehouse is used for mining, querying and analyzing the data. These analysis are used for business improvement. Data warehouse improves product development, marketing, pricing strategy, production time, historical analysis, forecasting and customer satisfaction of your business. ETL ETL process ETL stands for Extract, Transform and Load. ETL is a process in data warehousing responsible for pulling the data out of source system and transform the data into the format required for data warehouse and finally places it in data warehouse. Now we will see one by one extracting the data. E extracting the data from source systems such as SAP, ERP, CRM and other operational systems. Data from different sources is connected into consolidated data warehouse format which is ready for transformation processing. Transforming the data makes transformation by performing the task like applying the business rules, cleaning, filtering, splitting a column into multiple column, joining together data from multiple sources that is merging, transposing rows and columns, applying simple or complex data validation. Finally, loads the data into data warehouse or data repository. Further, data in data warehousing is used in reporting, analysis and data mining for making the business decisions or improvement as we discussed earlier. Thus, data warehousing is explained. Thank you.